But we have a really good one coming up in 4A Saguaro and Sal Point Catholic. And I'm here with Sal Point Catholic offensive lineman Mateo Mele. Mateo, first off, congratulations on, on making the game. Uh, just what do you foresee for this game being uh, in your neck of the woods down in Tucson? Uh, well, definitely we're excited about that. It's almost kind of like a home field advantage being uh, at U of A. We don't have to make a drive up. But uh, we're just excited. The whole team is really excited, of course. No one on this team has been in the state championship, but uh, a lot of the kids on this team has had brothers that played in the 2013 team, so kind of like we hear stories, so we're all excited to play. Did they have any advice for you for those guys who had played in the state championship? Yeah, just all season. You know, they'd talk to us all season, work hard, keep your head down and keep grinding, and uh, if you work hard enough, you'll get there. And so we're here, and now we just got to keep doing what we've been doing. The Lancers have one of the best offensive lines in the entire state. What's it like blocking for a guy like Bijan Robinson? It's great. I mean, uh, Bijan, he's just he's the guy. He's just one of those crazy players that you can mess up. I always say this, and he'll you know score a touchdown. He doesn't matter. He'll run over you. He'll jump over you. He'll run around you. So he's just that guy. Uh, in terms of the leadership that Coach Benet brings, um, you know, it, you guys have had so much sustained success over the years. Uh, what's been his message throughout these playoffs to you guys? Um, really just all season we work hard and we work hard in the weight room and on the field, uh, conditioning, uh, practice, and we keep our head. We don't, uh, you know, we don't get cocky. We don't try to do too much. And so Coach Benet's kind of always preached that, be a good guy on and off the field and, uh, that's just kind of carried us throughout the years, and I think we have had a record of success thanks to that. What have you seen out of the Saguaro Sabercats in, in your prep work uh, for the game a couple weeks from now? They're just they're a good team. I mean, uh, they played a tough schedule early on, but they're uh, they're physical, fast, tough, strong. You know, they've always been a good team, and uh, we, just like last year, you know, it's kind of the same idea going in there. We just got to play our kind of football, uh, dominate them off the line, be physical, and hopefully we'll get a win. All right, going to be a good one down at Arizona Stadium on December 2nd in 4A. It's going to be the number two Saguaro Sabercats against the number four South Point Lancers.